What up, I'm Devin on deck, and today we're going over my August pickups. I'm Welcome back to Style on Deck, where we talk about fashion, personal style, grooming, and everything else in between. Today, I got some extra exclusive footwear to show you from Puma, but before we get into that, if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please do. Sneaker unboxings on this channel either focus on niche brands that you may not even know about or interesting collaborations, limited runs, and special editions from larger brands. So if that sounds good to you, you are in the right place. And if you already subscribed to my channel, make sure you hit that little bell icon so you get a notification every time I drop a video. For those of y'all who follow me on Instagram, you know that a couple weeks ago, Puma flew me out to Las Vegas, Nevada to go check out an early preview of their collection and collaboration with XO slash The Weeknd. And simultaneously, it was also a concert. He came out, he rocked the house. I've never actually seen that man live before. I'm telling you, sonically, that man can sing. I had no idea he was actually that good live. You know, you never know until you see him, and it was tight. So if you were able to catch that on my Instagram stories, thank you for paying attention. I'm glad I could share that with you. Amazing. The only sad thing, though, is that I actually couldn't get a pair of shoes. I couldn't bring them along with me. And then a couple weeks later, on my doorstep, Booyah, okay, hello. So let's start with the box first. This is a very simple, straight to the point box, okay? Nothing crazy going on here. You have the Puma logo, separation line, and the EXO logo here. On the side of the box, you have the Puma and EXO logos at the top corners, literally on every edge of the box. It has a magnetic latch to it, like you see on some boot boxes. I think it's kind of tight. Listen to it real quick, let's see if we can hear it snap. There it is. Okay, that's the Magnus latching on, all right? Open this bad boy up, and without further ado, we got the Puma XO Parallel. Ladies and gents, off the rip, the first thing I noticed about this boot is that it's very lightweight for a sneaker boot. I think it feels just like the weight of a normal sneaker, and not too heavy, not too clunky, especially when you got a thick sole like this. It's good to see that and feel that it's not too heavy. So that's a plus. Also this leather right here, this leather is like super supple, very soft, very porous, almost like an eggshell color. I'm not sure if you can see it on camera, but it's like an eggshell, grayish, white, even though the color is called Blanc de Blanc. So white, white, yes, but not really. The top is like an off-white, little bit of an eggshell, a little bit of a gray. If you look at this Puma swoop on the side, it actually connects it goes all the way around the shoe to the other side as well. The reason why I'm almost 100% sure that this pull tab is not functional is because you got a zipper right above it, about a three inch zipper that's gonna help you take the shoe off and on, slip your foot in and out. I'm not really a big fan of untying shoes. Now, as we look closer at the lace panel here, you notice that all the eyelets are gunmetal and pretty flat on the surface, except when you get to this very top one, really close to the collar here. It's a little bit more rounded, and you see it's in the shape of a half circle, mimicking the top portion of where this lace panel meets the collar. I think it's a really dope design detail. You have the XO Puma on the tongue, as well as a little bit of this pull tab. On the other side of the pull tab, the opposite side, there's an X. Not sure what that X is for. I'm not sure it's meaning XOX, because it's not in the exact same shape of the logo. On the midsole, we have four lines going from the center point around the heel and then to the center point on the opposite side of the shoe. In the back, you're gonna see this chiseled, very pronounced heel, definitely military inspired. And then you look at the very bottom and the tread is pretty basic. You have the Ignite on the front toe, Puma XO on the center, and a little bit of a tread design on the heel. So there it is, the Puma XO Parallel. If you want to check these boots out for yourself, I will leave info and links in the description. And I have not tried the boots on yet, but by the time this video comes out, I will have tried them on so I can answer any questions you have about fit, size run, etc. Leave any feedback or questions in the comments and I will answer them for you ASAP. If you enjoyed this video at all, make sure to give your man a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please do. I appreciate your time as always. And I'll see you on the next one. Peace.